Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when virus and threat protection is missing from Windows security on your Windows 11 computer. So in Windows security, here you can see virus and threat protection. If this option is missing in your Windows 11 computer, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now to fix it, go to this location. So open registry editor. So type in registry editor in Windows search box and then click on registry editor. Now click on yes to allow. Now, before you make any changes in the registry, just create a backup for the registry. So go to file and then click on export, select desktop as a location and you can type in backup. And then you can select for export range, select all and then click on save. Now this will take a couple of seconds or maybe a minute to backup the registry. So once the backup is created, over here you can see the backup file is created. Now, in future, if something wrong happens, you can always restore the registry. To re restore the registry, go to file and then click on import. And then you can select the backup file over here, backup registry, and then click on open. This will restore the registry. Now, to fix the issue, expand H key local machine. Now expand software. Now expand policy expand policies and then expand Microsoft and then find Windows Defender Security Center. Expand it and here you can see virus and threat protection. So make a right click and then click on delete. So you have to go to this location and then you have to make a right click on virus and threat protection and delete the folder. You have to delete this entry. Now, in many, in many Windows 11, you won't find this Windows Defender Security Control uh, Security Center. You may only see Windows Defender. So, if you don't see this option, you can skip this step. You don't have to do anything. You don't have to delete. If you don't see this, you cannot delete it. So, you can sp skip this step, and then once you delete this, okay, now restarting will. Now after the system restart, copy this command. This command is provided in the video description. So copy this and then type in CMD in Windows search box and then make a right click on command prompt app and then click on run as administrator. Click on yes to allow. Now paste the command over here. Hit the enter key. And over here, you can see reinstall option. If you see install option, click on install. If you see the reinstall option, click on reinstall. Even it tells you Windows security is already installed. Just ignore this, click on reinstall, click on reinstall and let the installation complete. You can launch it and check if it does it, if it does not launch, do not worry, close this window. After reinstall, you have to restart your computer. Make sure that you restart your computer after this. You have to restart your computer and after the system restart, you can Open Windows uh, Windows 11 settings, go to privacy and security, Windows security, and then click on virus and threat protection, and you should be able to see virus and threat protection. But still, you're facing the problem. In that case, you can update your Windows 11 using Media Creation Tool. Media Creation Tool. So you have to download this media creation tool and update your windows 11 using media creation tool go to this website here also you will find media creation tool click on download now and then run this exe file click on yes to allow now this will load windows 11 media creation tool now click on accept by default, Windows 11 would be selected. Click on Next. Select ISO file, then click on Next. You can save the location. You can set the location as desktop and then click on Save over here. Now, once the download is complete, click on Finish and then go to Desktop, Find Windows ISO file. 
make a double click on windows iso file then run the setup file make a double click on setup file click on yes to allow this will load windows 11 now and here you can see install windows 11 click on next it will check for update then click on accept again it will check for update now before the installation you will see the screen which says ready to install and by default the option to keep personal files and app would be checked when this is checked you will not lose any data on the computer click on install after the installation log into your computer so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to get the virus and threat protection option back in your windows 11 security so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to me